guys, welcome back to Wall U's FC. Today we have a big, big match against Islanders nearing the end of the season. We're only three points ahead, and I think if we win this game, we pretty much wrap up the title. Because if we win, we'd be six points ahead. And, like, if you look at the schedule here, there'd, if there'd only be three games, we'd really have to mess up. So this is play. This is a big game. Second place versus first place. If we win, we can pretty much seal the title, as I just said. In the last episode, we played Virgin Order, and well, no games have been played before that because we've just had two big games, um, back to back. So I figured I'd play them. Same stuff as usual here in the tactics area. Blah -de blah blah. Let's get straight into the action. Mm -hmm. Come on, game mode. Sorry, I was feeling feeling the music there. I felt musical in there. I'll try not to hum this video. But anyway, we'll use Islanders. We've never been an Islanders so far, but I'd like to change that. Same instructions. It's going to be a tough game, but I think we can still play on the attack. I still feel confident. I mean, we've been on a really good run lately. So here we go, to potentially wrap up the title, while we'll use Islanders, let's do this. We are favorites to win with evens. We'll use are a good team, but I think they have enough quality to see off the challenge of Islanders FC today. Andy Davis will be a big miss for Islanders FC. Trevor Peters being our key man. Let's hope he can stay composed in front of goal. We'll just send the assistant here. So it's pretty much 4 3 3 versus 4 3 3, but there's a little bit more defensive. And they're in its wide. Ours is narrow and pretty offensive. We do O Islanders. We gotta win this one, boys. Okay, let's get this team motivated. Let's do this, boys. Let's get out there and win this one. So here we go. Peters kicks off to Johnson. Johnson passes to Daly. To Morris. To Roach. Daly, Peters. Back to Daly. Daly running back. He finds Smith out wide. In the highlight. Morell tries to clear, but Monks intercepts. Who plays James? Finds Lennon. Who finds Ryan out wide? As a problem I've noticed, we are a little bit vulnerable wide. We, we'd like to play narrow, so we are pretty vulnerable out wide. Perhaps I should change that. As a matter of fact, I probably should change that. Yeah, see that vulnerability ally just killed us there, didn't it? So I mean, so we could change the tactics up a bit. Because it's not working out wide. Maybe we could change like our fullback's instructions. Hmm, how would I do this? I want to talk about their defense. Maybe I could tell them to close down more? I mean, we'll try it. Oh, I just hit cancel. Wait, wait a minute. Maybe I could work on the instructions. But playing arrows worked for us, so it just... Hmm... It's just the defense that kills us when they, they when it's out wide. So maybe I could expand us to be more balanced and not play scenario. I mean, we'll give it a shot. 
plays out wide on the wing is what killed us there. I think we'll give it a go. But we're 1 0 down 6 minutes in. Not good. Yeah. A good goal from them, to be fair. But again, just playing out, just winging. Plays from the wing is what is what's killing us. Got a corner kick, but if we clear it out, but only right to Miller. We have space. Ooh, but he skies that one. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we told our team to cover Miller. He's their key man. Virgin Gorda and Old Madrid are equal now. Saying that Virgin Gorda just took the lead. 30 minutes gone, we're still down, which is not ideal. We're pretty equal in terms of shots, but they got a clip, they have clear cut. One minute added on. Well, this isn't ideal, not ideal at all. I know we can do better. Come on, boys. I'm sticking to the tactic, though. I still believe. Alright, we got a throw in with Smith, who plays Trevor Peters. Trevor Peters plays out wide to Daly. Who plays wide to Smith. Taking it more wide, looking for the cross. Can't find a bit. Smith keeps it. Gets another cross, and then Johnson with equal. It moves us back up to first in the table with that goal. It's currently 1 1, 52 minutes played. Big goal. Come on, boys. We can still get this one. Oh, Miller gets subbed off. That's interesting. They, they are, Miller is their key man. As I said before. But we got to throw in with Morton. To Morris. To Moss. Trying to whip it in. But intercepted by the Islanders defense. James is chasing it back. Don't slow down. That was not a smart idea. I got Fisher out in space. Good save. That was poor from James, was it? Yeah, James. That was pretty. I don't know what he was doing. He had no one around him. He just cleared it out. Could have held on to that. Moss plays Trevor Peters. Trevor Peters. Back to Moss. And a highlight. I don't even know what subs to make. We got another throw in from Morton who finds Morris who puts it up in danger, but Butler wins it. Do I really want to make a substitution is the question. If we could probably do a taking off James, I mean that mistake was pretty bad. Even though it didn't concede a goal, it could definitely could have, but Fred wasn't gonna be beating your post like that. So but Butler lifts it up, intercepted by Smith to Daly, to Roach. Roach trying to find Trevor Peters on the run. He gets tripped up. Is that going to be a penalty? It will be a penalty. Well, this this penalty could be the penalty that could pretty much pretty much seal us the title if we can do it. It's all going to be at the feet of Trevor Peters to wrap up the title. Ryan's shown the yellow. Peters puts it on the penalty spot. This is big. This is big. Get in. Get in. We just got a hold now, and we could pretty much have won the title. That's, that is big. That is the biggest penalty I've ever seen. That 
pretty much seals the title if we can hold the win. Alright, time to we just need to park the bus now. I'm gonna drop daily into holding midfield. We're just gonna We're just gonna see out this win. Let's play defensive, let's just park the bus. And we once that final whistle blows, we've pretty much won the title. The only way we won't win is like we really mess up near the end of the season, but I don't see that happening. Morris. Trying to find a run of Johnson. Robinson intercepts, plays it back to Butler. Butler lifts it up to Lennon, intercepted by Smith. Trevor Peters on it. Could we get one more? I don't know. But we shall see. To Roach. It would be nice to get one more and make this lead a little bit more comfortable. But only five minutes remain. Ooh, Johnson wins it. But James is good to kitty, but we James makes a really good tackle to Morris. Gets the shot away, it's three one. And I think the win has been sealed. And potentially the title as well. I mean I know I shouldn't say we've won the title yet, but I mean if we beat Islanders here, it's all but wrapped up, really, and I highly doubt we'll mess up near these last two or three games we got left. Smith, the daily just blow the final whistle, ref. Vanterpool, Fardwell, Morton. And that's the final whistle? No. Should be blown in your second now, though. There it is. 3-1 the Warriors. And that is just a good win to get. That was a huge game for us. I'm very proud. The Jesus goes six points clear, and it's looking good. Quality of possessions provides victory. We weren't the key match, but our match was probably more important, but it wasn't as exciting. But Morris is on fire, which we gotta praise him for that. Appreciates it. So that sees us six points clear in first with just three games left in this season title is looking like it will be ours but that's me in this video boys and girls see you guys later i've been wolfie and i'm out